What's going on, everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are having a great day. Welcome back to Mercury Farms. Today, we've got quite a few things to do. We've got all of our poplars built up, but we need to get them collected. So we're going to use some of the new stuff from the Anderson DLC to collect them all. Also, we need to upgrade to a new cedar. She's getting a little too small for the fields that we've got. So we're going to get us a new one and put some canola in G2 and this field that we're on top of right now. And we need to feed the animals. So what I'm going to do, show you how to feed all of the animals with the new Buy Anything mod. Let's jump right into it. There are quite a few Anderson trailers that we could use as well as a couple in game, but we're going to stick with this guy right here. So we're going to go into tools. We're going to go down to baling technology. We are not buying this. We are simply going to lease it. We're going to get the RBM 2000, not the Pro. We're going to go for the regular 2000. This thing is awesome. It's 20, what, $22,000 cheaper, but we're just leasing. We don't even need to buy it. There we go. We've brought over our Massey 8737, biggest one we've got. The reason being, we're going to put 24 bales on this thing. 24 bales is going to be extremely heavy. So what we want to make sure is we can get pulled around all nice and good. Hooked up? Oh yeah, I'm so hyped. Rolling through, let's go ahead and fold this guy out. And you know what? Let's hit it in a clockwise fashion. We've got a whole bunch of these guys. I think we've got like 46 or 47 bales total. So this ought to be pretty fun. This took forever, by the way. I think it took around 30 minutes to do the entire field. Ridiculous. I mean, it's not ridiculous. It took way longer than I wanted it to. There you go. That's how ridiculous I thought it was. Boom. Pow. Got it up there. Triple stacks. Three high. Let's get us another one. Oh, no. Yeah, we got it. All right. So let's get these guys picked up. I know we're going to need two row or two, uh, two row two stuff. Yep. Speedy time. Let's do it. So there is a new update here for Mercury Farms, if you guys didn't know. So go ahead and make sure you go to your consoles, your PC, your Mac, whatever you're playing on. Make sure that you update to the new version because it's going to allow you to sell poplars or poplar bills rather. Now, if you have these on a normal trailer, they're just going to start selling immediately when you pull through right there and they would have all been sold. But we have them on an auto loader. And when they're on an auto loader, they technically don't exist. Which is why we've got to back up to here. Ah, uh, yeah. Right about there. That ought to do. Let's go ahead and get it ready for unloading. Perfect, perfect. And simply unload, and they will automatically sell. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah! <laughs> There you go. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's take a look and see what kind of money did we make. Let's see. That's not the right one. Sold vehicles? Nope. Sold buildings? Nope. Not today. We, we may not even know. Let's see. Sold wood? Maybe. Sold bells? 14563 Not too shabby. Now, we did have some more bells over here. I'm looking at this thinking to myself, you know... I don't know, but I think we're going to have to make three runs. I'm cool with that, definitely. I mean, we've made, what, 14 grand already? We'll make 25, 28, 29 grand off of three or two runs. Maybe a little bit more. I don't know. What do you guys think? Last I checked, it didn't say that we would need to do three, but we'll see. Let's see how many we get off of this one field. So we only got 21 bales. So sad, so sad. What we do need to do before we take off, we need to set a worker over here and get this field done up. Boom, there we go. Good, yep, good for me. Let's jump out of there 
And let's jump back in here and get this sold. Hop in. Boom. Is this on? No, it was not. But it is on now. So from the money we made on the last one, I assume we'll be getting close around $13,000. So possibly $27,000, $28,000 total for the sale. Not too bad, to be completely honest with you. Do I think it's worth it? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Absolutely not. Of course, I don't think anything that you can't hire workers on worth it anyway. Because that's your time. Time is worth money. How much is your time worth? That is right. We also got some round bells over there. And we've got square bells all the way across the other side of the map. <clears throat> Excuse me. What we did before the DLC came out is we prepared a couple different fields. Three fields, to be exact. We prepared one field with square bells, square grass bells. One field with round grass bells. And then we did a field of poplars. Well... We're done with the poplars. <laughs> Probably not going to be doing poplars for a good while. So make sure you guys enjoyed what was going on here. But we've still got those fields to go. Now I'm thinking in a live stream, we're going to use uh, use the Hybrid X extractor and the, uh, was it the IFX 720 extractor? We're going to be using both of those in a live stream, I believe. We could do that in a video, but I think something like that would be way cooler in a live stream to show you guys how that works. And, heck, by the time this comes out, I may have already streamed that. You never know. You never, never know. So let's come back up through here. Let's get these sold again. What are we going to make off of these? Hopefully it is very good money. Again, I've also got to get us a new cedar. I've already got it planned. I've already got it picked out. I know which one we're going to get. We're just going to double check and make sure. Well, I say funds are there. Funds are definitely there. We have $732,000. That's getting ready to go up as well already moved our old cedar over so we're good there no worries whatsoever all we have to do is head straight to the store from here now one thing i did notice last time is you need to be backed in not far just make sure it's on the pile here don't back in and expect it to be you know kind of right there it's a square it's in the middle just back up as far as you can and you'll be good to go unload and it will start taking them and, oh yeah, making money. Boom, 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 boom. Sold. What's our money? Sold bills. 27914 There you go. That is our total make off of that field. Was it worth it? Nah. <laughs> For the time and the money, I don't think so. Just to be honest, I don't think it was. Is it cool? Oh, yeah. Are people going to love it? Oh, heck yeah. Did I? No. <laughs> Not much for bailing anyway. It's, it's uh, you know, it's cool. It's different. But at the end of the day, it's just another form of bailing. That's all it is. Don't hate it. Just probably not going to use it for a while. Regardless, we are going to get a new cedar today. So there is our old cedar. Now, we are going to be selling both of these. Well, say selling. We're going to be getting rid of both of them. Let's get this backed into there. Nice. And let's, you know what? Let's just go ahead and put that one in there, too. What's better than two implements in one place? Not much. Let's get it in there. Come on. Push, 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 push. Oh, don't do it over. Don't overdo it. There we go. Yeah. Definitely both of them should not fit in there. And yet somehow, some way, we've managed to make it happen. Goodness gracious. Now, the only thing that would be funnier is watching this raise. Aw, it didn't take the thing with it. It did push it through the force field at the end, though. That's pretty cool. Let's repair and sell and repair and sell. There we go. 80 thousand dollars what are we gonna buy so what did we get we're back at the main farm now boom baby we got the amazon that's my favorite one i love the amazon so much yes <laughs> let's come through and fill it up here we go about right there seeds yes please fill it up as high as it can actually you know what we can fill it up with this i think too right let's see uh 
only fertilizer. Is that correct? Let's see. I'm not getting another... I'm not getting another pickup. So it looks like that's only going to do seeds or fertilizer. Not both. Interesting. I've always wondered why those like fill anything mods. Why they do that. Ah, got me. I don't know. Well, what are we going to do? We are going to be doing canola. That's right. Canola. I talked yesterday and said, man, you know, we need canola, but we also need to do wheat. Well, can't we do both? Yes. The answer to that is yes, yes, we can. And we are going to. We're going to do it in this field and in the field that we had our poplars in. Let's go ahead and fold this bad boy out. Yeah. Direct drill. It's got everything we need. So, I mean, it's my favorite one. It's my favorite cedar right here. Absolutely. Without a doubt. All right. Nice and easy. About right there. Turn it on. Give it a little fast farm click. And up the hill we go. Looks like this idiot forgot a few little things down here. You know, it's it's interesting. I, I give it every chance. I hit the headlands and still on a straight line. He's the dumbest thing under the sun. Talking about you there, buddy. Talking about you. Well, not, not you. That's me. That's me. Shut, shut up. <laughs> Pull this around down here. Just get it out of the way. This is a tough field. It really is. The unfortunate part is we can't sell this plot, this plot of land, I don't think. Nope, because we've got we've got something on it. It goes all the way down to, I mean, like, legit. All the way down. We really should buy, like, I say buy, we really should go through and take all those trees out. Because that's a lot of land we're just letting sit in their waste. Unfortunately, it's got a bunch of the, uh, the trees in it that we don't want to deal with. Because, well, we don't have anything to deal with them. The Rayboard Zylo was perfect for those undesirable trees, like those right there. Unfortunately, you really got to get in there with a, uh, well, something else to get those out. Got to get in with a chainsaw and, and do it all the, uh, the right way. And Yeah, that's not how we do logging. So until something like that comes out, I doubt that we will go through and make all that happen. I would love to. I'm just not sure that that's the dealio. Yo, look at the ground. You could tell where the uh, poplars were because it's all uh, like some of it's cultivated. Some of it had already been cultivated. Some of it needed plowing. Some didn't. And the parts that didn't need plowing just got fertilized again, which is hilarious. Let's see if we can go through and see a... Uh... Yeah, look at the fertilization. That's awesome. Oh, that's so cool. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love seeing weird things like that happen to the map. All right, can we get around this tree? And, oh, we got hung up just a little bit. We're good. Yeah, yeah. And this is exactly why I have bought this plant, or the cedar right here. We're getting this whole thing done super fast. I love it. I love it. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, let's get this done. I think we got a little extra time to do some stuff that maybe we weren't planning on doing today. Such as... Uh, well, we got to get rid of that pile beller first thing. <laughs> That's got to go. I don't want it anymore. We don't need it. There's no point to have it. And be honest with you, that case, we could probably keep it, but we're not going to use it for much. And I would really like to get rid of some equipment that we're not using. Because there is, and I admit, a lot of equipment that we have that we're not using. I'm not proud of it, but it is what it is. Look at this. This, this uh, field looks amazing. I love it. So maybe we take a little bit of time out of our busy schedule today to sit down and just get rid of some equipment that's just sitting there. So our farm has huge expanses. Lots of area, lots of stuff. 
a whole lot of stuff. It's a very long farm. If you think about it, it goes straight back. Nothing is kind of squared off. It's all one huge rectangle from one side to the other. But what do we have that we don't need? Let's go into the garage. And let's really look at each piece of equipment and make a decision right now because I want to clear some stuff out. Nope. 7240 Pro. I know some of you guys wanted to see this used more on the farm, but unfortunately, with the fast track, I mean, well, the fast track doesn't have as much horsepower as the case. And we use the fast track. You know what? We're keeping the case. Shutting that door. T9. Sorry, gotta go. We haven't used it yet. There's no point to have it. Two semi trucks. I, I see a use for both of them. Wheel loader. Absolutely not. Roll through. Headers, those are good. These are all good. We use these. Bam, this guy right here, the bio bailer. Peace. Let's see, what else do we have? The trailer. Eh, trailer's okay. It looks good where it's at. Let's get rid of this leveler. Let's see here. Let's go through here some more stuff. See, oh man, I don't know which one's which. Let's go for the one that's zero hours. That's the one I think we're going to sell. Let's see, one for bales, and eh, we'll keep it just in case. Oop, we got the bumper for the bio beller. Let's get rid of that. Roll through here. We got silo extensions, bunkers, all this good stuff. Let's see, this guy we can get rid of. There's no point in keeping that. And I think, yep, that is good there. So we just done made ourselves a pretty penny. What about land? Because we do have some land on here that I don't think we need anymore mainly the forest area so we are going to sell the forest the biogas plant so then while we still own placeables oh that's right there's placeables on it i don't know what to do we'll, we'll hang on to it for now it biogas you're saved for now let's see we still have bells on 6 and 51 so we can't sell those yet Eventually we will, but we can't yet. And of course, we have our long field here. So that means that we've got G1, 3233 is one field. G2, 36, 35, 34, that's a second field. Field 29 is a third. Field 30 is a fourth. And field zero is what I'm going to call it, is our fifth field. So we have all of that. Yo, speaking of, did I not plant anything in... 29 no i forgot to plant so we got to go over there and plant some other stuff goodness gracious we got all that so now how about feeding our animals can we feed all the animals we have just from the buy or the place buy anything mod that was it the, the black tube over there why yes yes indeed we can with a few caveats to think about we have a lot of animals all of our animal pens with the exception of the pig pen are maxed out right now and heck, even the pig pen could be maxed out, and I just don't know it. So let's back this guy up right here. Boom. Now do keep in mind, this is available for console as well as PC, what we're about to do. So if you guys are playing on any platform, you can copy this. Let's take a look at our animals and see what they need. So cows need straw and some TMR. Now we've got TMR, but we're going to use the purchase TMR. We need grass and hay for our sheep. We need, well, grass and hay for the sheep there. And then our piggies need corn, wheat, canola, and sugar beets. Now, of course, again, we have all of that, but we're not going to give them what we have. And our horses seem to be doing just fine right now. So what's first on that list? Very top, cows, they need straw. So let's roll through here, find straw. Boom, we have straw. And the straw is full. Costs us 2,600 bucks to get 59,000 liters of straw out of that thing. Gotta tell you, that's a pretty darn good price. That's a pretty good price indeed. So let's roll through here. Let's give these guys some straw. And I don't know if they're gonna take it all. If they do, great. If not, it's fine. We've got the pigs opened up as well, who also desperately need straw. So we're gonna give both of them straw. And if you've got extras of anything, so any of the wheat, barley, whatever you need to give your animals, any extras, 
can go right into your silo. You don't have to worry, not a thing. You don't have to worry about, oh man, I've just wasted this, or, you know, oh, I've got to go sell this at the barn now. Nope. Just put it in your silo. You're good to go, especially on Mercury Farms. Your silo will work now. Placeable silos will not. You need to have a nice little cheeky mod if you want to be able to put that in these placeable silos. But nonetheless, works just fine. And you can take all of your animals. I mean, we've just done straw here. But you can take all of your animals and do the exact same thing. Just go through and start giving them stuff. Well, guys, that is going to be it for today. I hope you've enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like. And all right, please subscribe. If you guys made it all the way to the end, drop a hashtag GoHamFam all up in the chat right now. Ah, uh, yeah. That being said, hope you guys have a great day. And we will see you later. Peace.